Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Victoria 2 playing as the Empire of Brazil. Last time we continued beating up on Bolivia because, well, we love Bolivia a lot. And we also took a little colony in Madagascar because I wanted coal, but then I realized I can't build factories because it's a colonial province. Hmm. Oh well. So, in this episode, we're really going to focus on making sure that we get more education. Because someone said in the comments below, Capitalists will start appearing more and more once you get to 60% literacy, so... That's where we're headed. And we're also trying to get more research points, of course, as well, but, you know, we'll see what happens. We'll definitely see what happens. If we get more plurality, we could get more research points, which, which would be great. Right now, we're spending quite a bit of money. Let me lower that by a little bit. Good. A little more green. That's good. Oh, uh, I'm also at war with Persia because, well, the UK. Hmm. I really don't want to just, like, leave my alliance with them because it's always good to be in an alliance with a great power, but the UK is kind of iffy just because... You never know if they're actually going to help you or not. So, it is what it is. Also, I would love to get the reactionary party in here. Because they've saved capitalism, which allows us to build factories. But I can't. Because I can't select my select a new ruling party. However, we were looking yesterday. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy, what's going on here? Oh, South America, what have you done? British Fad Li. What is this? Kokin China Campaign. War of the Pacific. Demand reparations from Peru against Paraguay and Chile. Chile acquires all, of course. Five. Oh, hold on. Now, we are allied with these guys, and I, and I kept increasing my relations with them. But, um... I'm at war already. I can't really afford more war. But if I could break my alliance, and we could help destroy some more power that Peru has? That might be a good thing. I can't build any more brigades or divisions, can I? No, I cannot. Um, Paraguay, yes. So, we need to respond to this before August 26th. Which means, oh, I should not have by the time I need to do that. I need to do that. I need to do this. I gotta go max out taxes right now. I don't want to hurt my education budget, so I'll lower my bureaucracy budget for now, since we're almost at 100% anyways. So, let's other guys getting over there first. Uh, how strong are you? Three? Five? Oh, man, this is going to break our alliance, which isn't a good thing, but... Uh, I didn't want to go to war. I really, I was going to say, like, I really don't want to go to war right now, but... If I have to, I have to. Uh, that's unfortunate. Whatever. Alright, let's keep having good relations with people around us, including you guys, Buenos Aires. And then... Oh, the Confederate States. And they're not at war yet, just because, historically, they didn't go to war immediately. South Carolina seceded first, and then gradually more states seceded as well. So, uh, anyone else? Russia? Sure. How about we increase relations with you? Cool. Let's see what happens. You never know what might happen. Of course, they're in the mountains, so I'll probably try to take out the capital. We'll see what happens. I really have no idea. We should do okay, though. But I'm going to continue making sure that our literacy is really, really good. Oh. Nice. They're winning so far. Oh, hello. You're trying to siege me down? Oh, no. Child. You child. They are defending in... What is this? Grasslands. I got three defense. That's pretty good for them. So be it. I'm gonna go to Puno. Or Puno? Puno? Or not. Okay. Cusco. Let's go to Cusco, maybe. Yeah, I definitely don't want to attack them when they're in the mountains, so. Mm, not bad. Officer leadership's not too bad. Gradually increasing more and more there. I doubt we are the leaders of this. American oh, another American Civil War is fired. Wow, that's a little. Uh, not balanced. I mean, even though the Confederates had less soldiers overall, but still. Uh, where are we? War of the Pacific? Good. Yes, yeah, give me more liberal support. That's awesome. I love it. Eh, militancy isn't that high. Neither is consciousness. And it's going down, too. And we're, we're no longer at war with Persia, which is a good thing. I'm going to probably go straight for the capital, to be honest with you. Chartist rallies. Let them have their little rally. That's good. Oh, wow, our literacy dropped. Labor spies? 
That's not cool. Nice. I'm just gonna go straight for the capital. Now it costs us way too much. If we wanted to get a war goal immediately on them. Hussars. Ooh, Hussars, nice. Oh wait, what happened? What happened? Piedmontan restoration of the order to the Tuscan. Oh, oh god, guys. You guys are going crazy. Oh, you guys. Nice. Keep it up. Keep it up. Focuses. You're doing great. You're doing great. You're almost done there as well. Awesome. Nice. Hmm. Brazilian. And we've got the capital. Good. I mean, they'll take my province, which is really Bolivia's province, but it's really mine now. But that's okay. Oh, wow. There's only 4,500 people here, but 23% are Brazilian. That's cool. Good. Good, good, good. Awesome. Slowly taking more provinces away from them. Ayachuco. Acucho. 50% back up there. There we go. Demand reparations. Acquire all cores from Peru. I'm thinking, yeah. Nice. Because I want to get out of peace. Get to peace as fast as possible. It's just not worth being at war that much for us right now, so. I'm going to lower this by. Oh, that's a little bit too much, probably. Lower that by quite a bit. I want more upper class. Lower that as well. We need way more spending right here. Well, a little bit more at least. Nice. Return home. Oh, and then we got that. This seems like this little province could be a point of contention for a long time. Alright, so now we're at peace. And people are, are still immigrating to America. Even though they're at war. Oh, Buenos Aires, yes, yes. Good. 15.2, good. Now we're going to wait and lower our infamy a little bit more and more and more. As we get bigger and bigger populations. Which would be great. And my military really can't afford too much. Hmm. Oh, the North German Confederation is here. Or Federation. Not Confederation, but Federation. You guys are good. Austria, I don't really care too much. America dropped down in great power status because, well, the Confederates are here. But they probably won't be here for too long. Yeah. Oh my goodness. They're not going to be here for too long. Furniture. Awesome. Look at that. I love it. Actually, what extra factory glass? There's a lot of glass. All right, so what else we want to do? Impress. More immigrant attraction. Political awareness? Yes, give me as much political awareness as possible. I think that would be really good and help our education efficiency, so that's, like, absolutely necessary. So right now, we're probably educating everyone that's not a slave. Probably? I don't know. I doubt I can build any more people. I should encourage more uh, soldier pops, but for now, it's okay. I want to make sure we get maxed out bureaucrats first. How are the intellectuals here in Bahia? Three and a half percent. That's not enough. We're doing okay, though. We're definitely doing okay. And the Socialist Party was founded the last time as well. <clears throat> Political form design. Good. Good. Now, I think last time I said that I would love... Oh, Uruguay's there, huh? Movements to release... You know what? If I suppress these people, they'll come back more angry. So let's suppress them. No, UK, stop it. Stop it, UK. It's not worth allying them. It's really not worth it. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. Screw you, man. Screw you. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of you calling me into wars because I need immigration. And this is the perfect time for me to do it now since America's in war. They're still getting immigrants. Actually, people from us are leaving to go to America. But as long as Europe's on fire, I get a lot of green. And they still get hundreds a day. That's insane. But, you know what? <clears throat> I'm glad. Oh, Austria-Hungary. It must have had their Hungarian Revolution reform. Oh. Oh, what the? <clears throat> Excuse me. Wow. You're already starting a German-Russian war. You're fighting a lot of guys. Serbia, Montenegro, Greece, Bul... Oh, you're fighting the... Oh. So that's probably why you wanted me to come into the war. Yeah, no, 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 no. Let there be more war here. How's no one leaving Russia? It seems like this would be a big thing to leave, especially if the Germans are winning. Bavaria's looking pretty good. Spain's looking pretty good. Uh, France? Oh, uh, sure. 
I keep seeing that little yellow spot. I don't like seeing that little yellow spot right there. <laughs> uh, Germany's doing really well, though. I mean, this is almost like a World War I scenario, except Germany's allied with... Or the North German Federation's allied with the UK, and not fighting France. That's a bad idea, France. Now, they still want this. Wealth voting. Um... State controlled. I'm going to get all the political reforms done as fast as possible because I don't know the next time we'll be able to do this. And each time I say no, they'll continue raising their consciousness, which is good with me. Yes, more research points. Thank God, yes. State and government might be really good. Ooh, oh, more plurality could be really good. I could get more prestige. Fertilizer. Eh, it's, less, it's less than 3,000 points. We should do okay doing that. Tariffs, elections, that's okay. No, that won't even matter since we're not even spending stuff there. Nice, very good. So we're 100% there. Where else do we need reforms? Right there, or bureaucracy? Good. Bahia still probably okay. Mato Grosso, we're doing okay. We're gonna, we are patriots and we are going to fight for our country. Denmark, cool. <clears throat> Regardless, I do have a cup of good, sweet. Well, not too sweet. It's kind of not sweet. Brazilian coffee. We're almost level two. Oh my goodness. We still that. We still have that here. Hmm. I could subsidize them, but hmm. we want state capitalism. Definitely, definitely, definitely want state capitalism. Uh, what other parties? Oh yeah. We have quite the liberal support. <clears throat> mm. Build foreign factories. Allow foreign investments. Interventionism is just not great to have. Oh, oh, I do not want to become an anarcho liberal, though. No, 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 no. That's even worse. Lazar Fair and middle game, that's terrible. That would be absolutely terrible. Plant economy. Um. Well, does it say we can't build? Oh, we could. You know what? They might be anti-military and full welfare state, but they do have full citizenship, which is nice, and plant economy. So we could either go reactionary or socialist. I know they're different things but in real life, but that's still pretty good. Hmm. This might be good to do as well. State and government. Oh, my goodness. Go and do that. I'm really not focusing on the army at all. Oh, let's see. Emperor Napoleon disposed. Deposed. G the Count of. Hello. God, playing as France must be just absolutely wild. Just because it keeps changing governments. <laughs> oh, look. More education. Good. Good. Oh, so they peaced out. God dang it. Kill each other. Oh, Greece is there too. Yes. Germans, come to Brazil. You're probably. More educated than a good chunk of the populace. Uh, not so much you, Russia. Not so much you, but that's okay. Uh, the Qing Qing Empire. Oh, please. If they could westernize and send all their population to me, I would love it. Reform rally. The government wants to achieve reform. Become more conservative? No, 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 no. I can't afford conserv conservative parties. It's okay, but I can't build factories. Hmm. I see what you did there, Bolivia. You ally with Peru, huh? I'm going to increase my relations with Chile. Even though they're not that powerful, they're still good to have as an ally. So they have four military score, and you guys have five. And you have a lot of ships, so. Bolivia, you have zero. But I can't really, I just can't afford to go to war right now. I just cannot. Continue increasing relations. Netherlands, a great power. Okay, interesting. 17% education, not bad. Here, hmm. You guys need coal. I could expand it. We could try that once. Try that. Would that encourage any more capitalists to come? Probably not, honestly. Attacks them back up. I will lower the tariffs to five per zero percent, so people can get their needs that they need. Unification with South African Republic. Oh, Transvaal, nice. That's cool. A lot of Boers, Boers. Zosa.
I really want to say no because we did the same thing with them. I don't want to be called into pointless wars. Ah, Italy's back. Good. Italy's here. I'm sorry, France. I'm going to have to say no. I'm sorry. I really want to ally with America, though. Because they're mo most likely to be able to come down to us and help us out. Ally with Germany. Oh my god, Buenos Aires. What's going on, my friend? Oh, we'll be able to smash these guys, probably. Hopefully. I don't know. We'll see what happens. We need to answer the call by December 26th. Uh, Roman Thal, Papal States. Sorry, rich people. Gotta tax you a little bit more now. Or not. Or not. God dang it. Uh, that's why I allied with him. I was gonna call. I was gonna come to the war, but whatever. Uh, Argentina's here. God dang it. Uh, that just means we need more population then. You know what? You know what? I'm thinking here. Since they formed anyways, what if we try to ally them? And then we want to beat up Bolivia or Peru, they won't go to war with us. That might be a tactic we could employ. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, I got some Afro-Brazilians down there too. So what happened to the reforms? Is it possible for us to reform? No. What's this? Uh, yeah, I mean, hmm. Voters' ideologies. It's pretty split. Uh, God, hmm. Two score. They have three. Oh my goodness. They have one. How does Ecuador have three? Huh. Europe is definitely Europe. <clears throat> Excuse me. And perhaps we will find uh, a Franco Prussian war eventually. A Franco North German Federation war, perhaps. Cool. Integrated into the Empire of Brazil? Great! Yes! Another core cool state for the Empire. Can't vote anymore. I, mean, I can spend more money to encourage people to assimilate to come up here. Wait, what happened to you, Paraguay? Oh, uh, yes, we will ally you. I mean, we could probably take you out, but whatever. Nice, another national focus. Nationalism and imperialism. More plurality. Morale. Actually, it might be good to do another army tech just because we want to make sure that we're on the tip top shape of the army. <gasps> Mission to civilize. Oh, that sounds like fun. Social reform desire. Oh, the UK entered alliance with the Germans, huh? Ooh, that sounds a little disastrous. Good. Good. I might just do this as well, just to start doing this a little bit. Oh, I can't do that. That's right. Um, colonial appeasement, encourage mining. Get more coal out of there. Hmm. I don't want to piss them off, though. Migrants. Well, we'll leave that there for now. What else places? What other places need this? Oh, we're actually pretty good on administrative stuff. So, actually, how are you guys on intellectuals? So, Bahia, you're pretty much done. Rio is pretty much done. You need intellectuals. I'm going to put intellectuals down here as well. And then put some intellectuals here from Bahia. Good. Oh, that's disappointing. So maybe we can't beat up on Bolivia nearly as uh, much. Oh, no, no, no. So be it. No focus on ourselves. Educating the populace. Educate them better than these guys. America? Well, that was a fast civil war. Holy cow, it's not even 1865. Pretty Texan down in Texas. Well, CSA was defeated. Kingdom of France is kingdoming. Ottoman Empire is doing cool stuff. People are leaving Russia. Good. And what's I think it what, is it like once it's the seventies, eighties, nineties, in the nineteenth century, then we get a lot more population. I think. Good. More socialists. More anarcho liberal. Good. Oh no, Argentina is expanding. Oh no. I don't think I can do colony stuff. So. Yeah. Only I'm not even a secondary power. God dang it. Hmm. I mean we're ahead of everyone else here. I need more money. Oh look at that. What? 
You just took something away from me. Oh, commission a warship. Is it because we don't have money? That's nice, but whatever. Sign the Geneva Convention. Uh, we lose an infamy. We get more daily, more monthly infamy, though. Hmm. Hmm. Monthly war exhaustion. Recovery rate. Eh, we might as well. Let's reform the Brazilian colonial army. Democracy. Leaves. Oh, I'm in the UK sphere of influence. Protection. Integration Act sounds like the best to do. So we need political rights is not all allowed. Oh. Well, whatever. Suppression Act. Fatherland. Oh. The treaty? What is this? <clears throat> Mass politics after 1908. A life in a new world. How do we get this? Slavery? Oh. 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 I need to get rid of slavery immediately. I should have got rid of it earlier. Until for like two years you get 150% more. Oh, yeah. You know what? Let's hold an election. I'm going to call an election now just because we might be able to get more liberal support maybe. Eh, maybe not. Just because socialists and liberals don't like, you know, being with each other too much. To a degree. Church rallies. Good. There you go. There you go. That's exactly what we needed. Oh, I said I didn't want to get rid of slavery, but that, oh. Screw it, we're getting rid of slavery now. Slavery is verboten. And that immediately raised that up. Alright, so, that being said, we still haven't accepted people that are of a different culture, mostly Afro-Brazilian. Brazil, 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 where are you, Brazil? Oh, yeah, that's myself, what am I talking about? Um, RGT is looking pretty thick now. Uh, state capitalism. That's what we want. Education is just skyrocketing now. Well, I wouldn't say skyrocketing, but it's getting better and better. Let's see. It only took us until 1865, which is actually historically much better than in real life. In real life. Oh, Italy's here. Spain is here, too. Kingdom of Sp Whoa, what's that? What? what? Why are you so low? Uh, UK, we want to make sure we get good relations with you. Why is Austria-Hungary so large? Or so high? Do they get defeated? What the heck? Maybe they were defeated. Huh. Uh, there's one faith and one faith only. Cool. Nice. And we'll do that just in case. It's 1865. Industry. Medicine. More population. Growth. Yes, please. Yes, 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 yes. Hmm. Balance of power. Yeah, we're not really doing... Oh, uh, raise the tariffs protectionism. Well, let's get some more militancy if we can. At least we got rid of slavery, which is nice. Population-wise, I doubt people are really going to assimilate from Afro-Brazilian to Brazilian. But they could, eventually. Does not have country flag Jewish religion. Huh. That is different. Conservatives, they barely won. Afro-Brazilian, yeah, no assimilation. North German, good. So if we get rid of slavery, they must people will probably want to come here and spend more time here with us. Which is a good thing. Alright, uh, perhaps rearranged. Good, good. More liberal support. There's more liberal support now than conservative. There's more plurality. Now we can re-choose the trade policy. Good, that's fine with me. Um, yeah, no. Keep flexibility for now. You never know what we, what we might need in the future. Oh, yes, leave. No, come to Brazil, please, please. And we're also lowering our infamy, which is kind of nice. That being said, I, I really can't afford to go to war. But I would love to smash... Some more of these guys. You guys have any more babies you can make? Please make more babies. Oh, we have three industry. That's good. Hmm. <sighs> to kill those guys off, that'd be pretty difficult without... Oh, they even have cannons. Holy crud. Oh, that's not good. How did they get cannons already? Hmm. I could ship my army over to take out the rest of Madagascar. I could. But my budget says no. But, uh, do we have any more... We don't really have any capitalists. Go and tax them more. There you go. Tax them a little bit more for now. That's fine. We're getting medicine. Maybe we'll get some more railroads as well. That'll be good. Encouraging more intellectuals. More bureaucrats. They're doing well. There's more Afro-Brazilians here. I don't think we can really do much with them. Yeah. Unfortunate. Quite unfortunate. We're 18th in the world. We might want to get more prestige. Hmm. So that we can raise our standings to become a secondary power. Oh. 
Dishonored Military Alliance? Oh. Oh, they're fighting austria hungary Okay, that's cool. So now that the Empire of Brazil is a colonial power, it is tempted to decide a policy of how Brazilian colonial lands will be administered. Our people need more land to settle. Settlement. Oh, hold on, hold on. So let's go to reforms. Or no, it's uh, politics. Reforms. So we are currently non-colonial, which is a lie. Civilizing mission, which would be really awesome to have. Please, for the love of God, give me that. We could get indirect rule, which would give us more supply consumption. That's not bad, either. And settlement. Settlement <clears throat> hurts our tax efficiency, gives us more assimilation rate, immigrant attraction. Uh, that's not bad. Show rule through local leaders. Settlement, indirect rule. It is our burden to bring civilization to these ends. That, I think, is the best one for us to do. Because we get... Plus 10% assimilation rate, more prestige, more education efficiency. We want a civilizing mission. Awesome. But unfortunately, I'll be right back. Alright, sorry about that, guys. But let's continue regardless. So right now, we're making a, an okay amount of money. An okay amount. Not too bad. And now we have medicine for hopefully more population growth. That being said... Analytic philosophy gets unlocked in four years. We could do nationalism, imperialism, but really... Uh, oh, I love expansionism. Manifest destiny sounds like a great thing. The bias multiculturalism sounds great too. Introspection, eh. Let's get some more roads. I, I like roads, just... Ooh. That looks... Oh, I want that too, but... Let's get some more roads. That might encourage more people to come here, because who wants to come to a place that doesn't have good enough roads? Uh, I, I feels lacking when you're playing as a power. Oh, we're a secondary power! We're a secondary power! Because I was going to say, we can't core stuff or civilized places, but... Oh! Oh, this is going to be... Oh, we could actually core La Pampa or something down here? Oh, that is mean. That is totally mean. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad I looked. I'm so glad I looked. You know what? I'll ally you, France. Oh, no, 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 no. I know what's going to come historically. I can't ally you. I cannot. I just can't. I can't fight the Germans. I can barely fight the other people down here. Oh, my goodness. Yes, 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 yes. So now we need... We have medicine, don't we? need breech-loaded rifles and revolution and counter-revolution. Oh, if I could get this stuff before, like, Argentina or Chile does. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, I am truly... A colonial nation. Yeah, no wonder France wants allies. If the Germans and the British ally, <laughs> that's a that's a combo, man. That's like a that's a big combo. America, please do the gas and purchase. This is looking disgusting. Nice, not bad, not bad, cool. Oh, good. Up, oh, we got that thing we needed for. Oh, even more population growth. Amazing, and I'm doing here with my cat, Binky. That's, oh, part of the reason why I, you know, did fade in, fade out. Get my cat. Oh, my goodness. You, these guys can't even do it yet. Oh, my goodness, yes. Continue increasing relations with you guys. Uh, mobilization impact, that's good. And we've got, we got enough colonial power. I gotta say the secondary power, though. So, you know what? I might just say this for now. Just so that we have a little bit more industrial power. Because that's going to be a little important. To make sure we stay at number 16. Almost a quarter of our entire population can read right now. Oh, please come to Brazil. This is military hospitals. Great. Oh, what's going on in Italy? Why are they leaving? Are you at war? Or are you just... Yes, Austria-Hungary. Yes, yes. Go to war with Romania. Yes, my friends. Yes. Oh, oh, what the heck? Wait, when did Russia take out Lviv? 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 Oh, that is disgusting. That's actually really disgusting. Our budget isn't looking very good. Oh, we have some people here that don't like us. Um. So this costs 67.6 points and make the movement likely to be more radical in the future. Oh, yeah. Let's make the school people more radical. Look at that. Serbia, Austria, Hungary is just not having a good time. That looks really... Oh yeah. I'm actually going to give him roads right now. Now that is just beautiful. Oh yes. Yes. So we need revolution, counter-revolution, 
Breach loaded rifles. But yes. Yes. Oh, that is that is sneaky. That is just sneaky. Patagonian. What is this? Workers Committee? And the workers in the state run workers committee in one of our provinces has proposed that all local workers be given an extra day off each year on the account of the hardships they endure. While this would, in the grand scheme of things, not really cost us very much, it would still be seen as pandering overly much to the sensibilities of the working class and might give the riffraff bad ideas for the future. Well, I can't afford that. We're 15th in the world. Get back to work. We get prestige. Good. I actually would much prefer to give them, like, a day off. I would much prefer to do that. But right now, i got to think of the long-term goals. And unfortunately... That's just not in the cards. Oh, we got even better railroads. Yes. Let's go ahead and grab breach loaded rifles eventually. Or can we do... We can't do this one yet. It's not 1870, so we might as well go down to breach muzzle loaded rifles first. Nice. Oh, we can get a naval base. That's good. Uh, Rio, you're going to get roads. Rio's got to get roads. And do we have people here who want to spend money? No. Uh, we're already taxing people quite a bit. I can tax them a little bit harder, though. Nice. Mobilization impact. What's going on in the UK? The Canadian Dominion. They chose this can only be good for the Empire. Cool. 3.3%. Uh, 3%, 3%. That is at 3.3%. Nice. La Paz is at 1.7. Nice. We're really focusing on, on tons of intellectuals right now. Tons of intellectuals. Expanding the railroads. Great. Uh, if you can expand railroads here too, that'd be awesome. I doubt you can, since the, so there's like hills and mountains and deserts and stuff like that, so. <sighs> yes. Yes! Oh yeah, we can do this too. You know what? Who needs to colonize Africa when you can colonize South America? So you guys got grain. There's really nothing really special down here. But you know what? We're a colonial nation. Ah. <laughs> That just puts a smile on my face, guys. Oh, we got even one more pop here, huh? Nice. What do we need for this uh, pop, then? If we can make it better. Well, artillery is not looking great. I'm just going to get another infantry, dude. La Paz, Brazil. Oh, wait, La Paz. Was it? That's... Do you have a Bolivian? South Indian. Oh. Huh. Our army attrition goes down. 26% of our population can read. Good. Oh, there's some Patagonian... Palatian there. Good. Get as much research points as possible. 1868. Get a naval base. I'm not I need to make more money. I really do. Chile. Good, good, good. I want to go to war with these guys too. Uh the Ko Baung Dynasty, which is I think right there. Yeah. Oh, please, people leave. Leave these You're not actually leaving. Russia's getting a lot of Emigration away. We have four for industry. Colonial archaeology, just to play the bobble somewhere locally? Nah. This will teach future generations about the common heritage of mankind. So you guys have four. You're matching us. Their military score has been rising more steadily. More, 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 more. But we have way more prestige than them. You guys. Oh, God. America, get out of the, our sphere of influence. Or, you know, stop doing stuff down here. You're hurting us. If anything, if I could ally these guys again, that'd be great. I know I'd, you know, left my lot. Oh, they would accept. Uh, Germany, I think it'd be great if we could ally both of you. Because if we could do that, that's, that's a huge power block. We're ninth in the world in terms of prestige. That's awesome. That's really, really awesome. Come on. Nice. Let's get breach loaded rifles. It's not quite 1870 yet. Good. Holy state disturbed. Who gives a hoot about the religion? It's fine. Whatever. I'd love to make another army group down here. Oh, we can build roads too. Eh, it won't really affect them too much down here though. A city flourishes. Great. So the village of Parinbuna emerged in the early 19th century due to the occupation of the region by families of farmers and settlers coming from the former gold-producing region. The country of Parinbuna was separated from. Barbacena on May 31st, 1850, and was elevated to Parabona City in 1856, surpassing the city of Sao Yao del Rey. In 1865, the city of Parabona was renamed Ruiz de Fora. That's cool. You guys are allied with Peru. I just can't go to war now with these guys since. Uh, 
She went to war. Or, oh my god, America. Get out of here. Get out of here, America. America needs to be taken down a notch. Okay, so, UK. Germany. Or, basically Germany. Please kill off the United States. We definitely need you to do that. Would you like an alliance? God dang it, America. Ugh. Too many alliances? I, I don't think so. Don't decrease. Do that. Austria-Hungary probably isn't worth doing much with them. Do that. Uh, you guys, definitely do that. Spain, probably not worth it either. Argentina, for now. Oh, yes, bing bing. Cool, more attack. I like the attack. I like it. Alright, bing bing. Yes. Oh, an Arica earthquake, huh? That's not good. Better them than us. Alright. Just kind of waiting. Let's definitely get these breach loader rifles done. Very good. Oh. The cottage industry. Oh, we went down to rank 15 in the world instead of 14. Unfortunate. The wool district. Work harder. Smarter. Let's get some luxury goods. Uh, just in case. Go ahead and invest in that. Oh my goodness. We definitely need more money. It looks like we haven't taken out a loan. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. I'm going to lower that by a little bit. Perhaps. Begin integrating. Yes. That's fine. So really, I suppose... Oh, long live... Oh, nice! Nice. Great. The long-term goal is to unite as much of South America as possible. We probably won't get there, but I'm really going to wait for probably, like, great wars to happen and then piggybacking off of some of the great European powers to help me out. So Kingdom Italy is looking pretty... Oh, my gosh. You guys are... Oh, my goodness. I'm glad I didn't ally you guys. Holy cow. Austria-Hungary is looking absolutely terrible. Tensions dissipate good. Oh, my God. Romania, you're looking terrible. Uh, rock me in my cradle. Let's get some more prestige. That looks bad. Serbia's looking better. France. Ah, oh, what happened to you, France? The Germans didn't even go to war with you yet. That's nuts. Let's continue increasing our relations with them, though, but... Oh, we're 13 in the world. Great. Great. Yes. Nice. More pop growth. Vaccinations. I love vaccinations. Mm, come on. Research this faster. Oh, that's some more rail... Oh, we can't really afford railroads. We really can't. Oh. I'd love more railroads, though. Can someone please invest in railroads here? No? Okay. Does Rio have railroads? No, we're working on it, though. We're working on it. Can someone please invest in railroads in my country, please? It's kind of tough playing as a minor nation in South America, not going to lie. We're eighth in the world in terms of prestige. That ain't bad. Oh my god, France. How are you getting the snot beaten out of you by Italy? Now they're fighting... Okay, what what, what war is this? What war is this? The French liberation of Italian Savoia. Even the Russians are involved. The Belgians are involved. Oh, France. Uh, no, they might lose Algeria. But good. Lower their... Oh, it looks like Spain might have left the war. Oh, good, 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 good. It's almost 1860. God dang it. Um, that's going to take a long time. We want to get to this for even more research points as fast as possible. Because that's going to take a while to get to. So, we'll do a level 1 tech somewhere. Naval organization, supply range. Nah. Reinforce rate. Uh, we'll also just do naval stuff. The command principle. Unless there's something else here that gives us other stuff. now. Just do that. That'll be fine. We'll get it done in a little more than a month, probably. Hopefully. Oh, what's that? Oh, Belgium's down here, too. Elections, good. Alright, good. We got upper house rearranged. Be Whoa, what is that? Build the Belo Horizonte. This year, it was agreed by government officials that a new state capital and tomb of the modern and prosperous Minas Gerais had to be set. Due to climactic and topographic conditions, Correo del Rey was selected as Minas Gerais Governor Alfonso Pena, among other cities, as the location for the new economical and cultural center of the state, under the name of Belo Horizonte, or Beautiful Horizon. Araro, Araro, Rice, an urbanist from the state of Pará, 
was then set to design the second planned city of Brazil, <clears throat> and then Belo Horizonte was inaugurated, with many unfinished constructions as the Brazilian government set a deadline for its completion. The city flourished under the newfound iron deposits in the state. How does money? You have four life rating? Great, yeah. That looks great. That's awesome. Uh, Spain, sure, I don't really care, sure. Leave sphere of influence. Oh, I don't want to piss people off. Ooh, there's two treaties. Oh, okay, so that's with Colombia, so we can take this away from them. Which is always good. Give them full citizenship, absolutely. Oh, good God, I need more money. Mm. Good, six. Six, that's not bad. That's not bad. Oh, oh, I want the railroad so bad. Oh, yes, I love this event. So, land, liberty, labor. We organize a recruitment drive to get more upper people to immigrate to the colonies to establish a more permanent Brazilian presence in them. I also had found a colony which seemed suitable for such a drive, and the proposal is really only waiting our signature. We could not send colonies or get more population growth. I'm going to get more colonies. That's awesome. La Pampa. La Pampa. That's Buenos Aires. La Pampa. I'm actually building naval bases and railroads compared to my actual place. Huh. My actual area. New political party? Oh, what is that? Wait, what did I click on? Oh, migration. Yeah, that makes sense. Maybe that. Wait. Oh, this state is getting a lot of migration. Nice. Brazilian... Atenean. Oh, I got thingies here. Wow, we have a lot of socialists. Um, you know what? Oh, we can't. Oh, you know what? Let's let's see what happens. By May twenty first, we'll definitely know how many people we have. Oh, good. We have organizations eighteen seventy. I'm gonna immediately grab this social science. Oh my god. Ugh. And I want to see the results of the elections before we end the episode. Liberals and anarcho liberals. God dang it. Um, oh, no, 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 no. I can't do anything with my industry. That, that could hurt us. Or get more... Oh. God dang it. Hmm. That is... That is interesting. I can't help my industry now. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I can't tax people more. Oh, this is such a bad idea. This is such a bad idea. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to be running a deficit because I can't tax people more. Oh my god, that's really, really bad. So, that's where we're going to end today's episode. If you enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like. You know, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you all tomorrow as we struggle with Brazil some more. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.